How to carry kayaks with a travel trailer I became interested in kayaking a few years back. I joined a new group of RVers and thought it would be fun if I did it again. After several months, we decided to buy our own, so we won't have to rent them all the time. Next came the big question, how do we carry kayaks with a travel trailer? I asked around from friends and there was not a definite answer, although there were several options. Because of the different types of kayaks, I got different answers. Since we wanted all possible options, we did our research carefully so we can weigh our options out before getting one. Here are some of the tips we got. Strap the kayaks to the back of the RV. One of the things RVers do is strap their kayaks to the ladder at the back of the RV. It's easier to work with straps that you don't need to tie a knot so that you can release the kayak with less effort. What they usually use are straps with loops or drawstring straps that are easy to tighten. The straps should keep the kayak snugly in place to keep them from falling or scratching the RV or kayak. To prevent scratches, use foam pipe insulation and place it around the rungs and sides of the ladder. This advice may be simple but it's really practical and makes a lot of difference. Buy a kayak crack that fits in your trailer's itch. This might be obvious, but it's something that's often forgotten about if your trailer already has a hitch. Other people get so excited in getting a kayak crack, they get one right away and forget to check the size of their hitch receiver. So, check your trailer hitch connection to make sure you purchase a compatible kayak crack. Get a roof rack for your RV. A roof rack adds to your storage space. It can carry kayaks and other large items such as luggage, water containers, etc. If your RV doesn't have one, you should consider getting one for your kayak and other stuff, saving space indoors. Online you'll find fit guides so you'll know what type is best for your RV depending on the make, model, and year. While roof racks are the top choice for many RVers to carry their kayaks, some aren't comfortable with this. They would prefer to place their kayaks at the back because they find it more stable. They find carrying kayaks on the roof risky due to wind pressure when driving at faster speeds. Also, if the kayak is not secured well, it can be a hazard to you and the other motorists on the road. Carry the kayaks on the roof of your vehicle. Some RVers recommend getting a roof rack on your car to carry the kayaks. There's also a cool hack using pool noodles to secure the kayak and protect your vehicle. It's cheap so you don't have to spend lots. Here's how to do the pool noodle solution. Get some pool noodles that are strong enough to handle the weight of kayaks and two ratchet straps. If the pool noodles are longer than you need them to be, cut them as you see fit.
you'll need at least two pool noodles to ensure stability and to keep the kayak secure. Measure the length of the kayak against the car's roof and put the pool noodles on both ends of the roof. Think of the noodles as a regular rack and place them where the rack would normally be. Place the kayak on top of the pool noodles. A partner should help you with this so that you can balance the kayak in the middle correctly. After the kayak and noodles are adjusted, fasten the ratchet straps on each end of the kayak. To keep it from falling off during the trip, secure it even better by tying down the bow and stern. Try Kayak Trailers If you're becoming more serious about kayaking and you'll be carrying more than one, then kayak trailers are the best solution. Although it's a bit pricey, it's more convenient than loading and unloading your kayak on top of the RV. Also, you can use it for other large items besides kayaks. But if you're trying out kayaking as a new hobby, I suggest trying the other options first. I'd normally only suggest getting a trailer for the die-hard kayakers or families that have multiple kayaks to transport, 